We're live and getting ready for what should be another great NFL matchup. We're glad you could join us for this game. It looks like just about anything could happen in this one as the Bills get set to take on the Eagles. I'm Al Michaels with my partner John Madden here to bring you today's game. When you look at how good an offense is, it all starts with a quarterback. They can do a lot more things with this guy throwing the football for him. He can make the touch passes or just fire one of the old bread basket if he has to. The Eagles have a few receivers that he likes to throw to, and here's one of them. There's no question these two have developed that chemistry, and he's always finding an open spot on the defense to give his quarterback a target to hit. It wouldn't be surprising to see them hook up a few times in this one. Wow, look at that pile of guys down there jumping and yelling. You can tell they can't wait to get out there in the field. And the captains are out there ready for the coin toss. Crowd is ready, the teams are ready, so let's get tonight's game going. Here's the kickoff team. He is lined up for the kickoff. Number 80, back to return. He kicks it off. He'll choose to just down this one and start the twenty. This is a good defense to call. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Cunningham with a man in motion. Carries the ball for three, maybe four yards. You should stop it with this play. It's second down and seven to go. Ball on their own 23. Jackson moves in motion. Cross play to the right. Number 25. Didn't have much to work with on that running play. That's because the defense did a good job anticipating the snap count. With an aggressive defense like this, a hard count could be an effective way to keep them off balance while trying to draw them offside. Jackson, the man in motion. Throwing. Nearly intercepted. Very lucky that wasn't intercepted. I'll tell you, he did almost everything right on that one. He was able to read the quarterback's eyes. He got himself in good position to make the interception. And when it got to him, it just bounced off his hand. Edwards into return. Here's the punt. He has it with some open field. And he's knocked out of bounds at the 44-yard line. Well, John, we've looked forward to this all week long. One of the top running backs in the league against one of the most dominant defensive units. Yeah, I've been looking forward to it. It's the old strength versus strength thing. This defense has a great front four and good team speed. This can be a heck of a game. Incomplete pass. Looking for something big on first down, but the pass off the mark. Second and ten. Ball on a 44 yard. Looks like he's changing the play. Man in motion. Crosses it out to the left. Evans breaks the play up in the backfield. Thomas couldn't escape the pursuit and was cut down quickly. These guys up front are very tough to block because they can use their size and strength to get excellent leverage on running play. Sometimes they struggle a little with their consistency, but they always seem to be a big factor when the game's on the line. Reed goes in motion. Flings it to the outside. Hits him in stride. And he's knocked out of bounds at the 43. Try not to get too predictable out there. Make sure you got a good mix of run and pass. They'll pass on first down. Throws it. Incomplete pass. That looked like a catch until he got nailed. Yeah, so good it knocked the ball right out of his hand. Kelly directing traffic. Man in motion. Hand it off. About a two-yard gain here. They'll be faced with a long third down play here. Ball on the 41-yard line. Third and eight. Ball on the 41-yard line. 
Using motion. Flings it to the outside. At the 30. And he's forced out of bounds at the 25-yard line. Try not to get too predictable out there. Make sure you got a good mix of run and pass. That's it. He Yo, sees something in the defense. Number 84, the motion man. Pressure. Looking downfield. Throwing. He finds his man. He's at the two. And he's ridden out at the seven-yard line. You're in a good position here. Get the snap, drop back, and let your guys get open. Don't force anything. Dropping back, under pressure. He's looking, scrambling. So they'll lose yardage on that tackle by White. Good coverage downfield. The quarterback nowhere to go. And it's never good to take a sack, but when there's nothing open downfield, you just can't throw it up there. coming growing almost picked off i thought that was about to be picked off john i bet you as soon as he lets that go he was wishing that he could have it back because that could easily have been an interception Set. using motion with the pass touchdown buffalo he tossed the ball to the receiver for the touchdown that was a great pass by the quarterback he delivered that ball where only his receiver could make the catch. Number 11 comes in to attempt the point after. And it's on its way. And he takes on the extra point. Just what they were looking for, John. Good play calling there. Key drive. Touchdown. Yeah, that was a nice job of keeping those chains moving and avoiding costly penalties. Now they've got to see if they can keep this momentum that they have established going for the remainder of this game. He got all of that one. He decides not to return this one. On their last drive, it was three plays and out, and now the offense comes out onto the field once again. Defense will stop him for sure. One yard to go. Set. Using split backs. Jackson in motion. You got him. Stay guys. Bring the pain. On the run. Number 25. Couldn't find any room on that one. They really hustle on the defensive side of the ball. They're very good at clogging up the line limiting the number of holes and cutback lanes at the back has to choose from. Hand off to the tailback. And he's brought down at the 34. Give this one a shot. The quarterback lines up with two backs behind him. Play here on first down. Closing in with the throw. And he goes out of bounds at the 46 yard line. So they have first and 10 here. Ball on their own 46. Bring that pain, baby. Dropping back the pass on first down. Brought it down and ran with it, but couldn't find any room. That's excellent discipline by the defense. They stayed in their lanes, and they got to him before he could even get going. Sideline to side. Pressure with the pass into the open. This offense having no trouble moving the ball on this drive. Yeah, and this defense is having a lot of trouble stopping. They can't seem to key on what they're doing and put an end to this drive. 
Throwing on first down. He can't wrap him up. He's at the 20. Cunningham won't risk trying for more. A start goes to call this one. Only one man back. Under pressure, throws it, drops the interception. John, it looked like that was going to be a turnover. Yeah, he had an excellent opportunity to end the drive right there. He just couldn't bring it in. Second and ten. Ball on the 14. Pressure coming. Gets rid of it. It's broken up. Good pass rush, forcing the incompletion. He really had to rush that throw. That was a situation where the defensive line made the job easy for the defensive backs. Buffalo puts its secondary in better position to stop the pass. Gets the pass off. With the adjustment, he has it. A display of great hands on that catch. That receiver has all the tools. will attempt to put up the first points of the day. The kick is up. A nice kick, and it's good. The kickoff team lines up. He gets the kick away. He got all of it. John, a great kick that time. The returner never had an opportunity. You can usually count on him to kick down there near the goal line. And having a kicker who can do that kind of thing really helps you win the battle for field position. Closing in. He's looking over. Throws it. Got it off just before they got to him. <laughs> he had to get rid of the ball in a hurry. So it's second and ten. Ball on their own 20. Set. Using motion. Tiger up. Dropping back, looking for a receiver, and it's complete. Breaks free of the defender. The 50, the 40, the 30, the 20, the 10. Touchdown, Bill. An amazing play that goes the distance. I tell you, when he got into the open, he wasn't anyone who was going to catch him. It just shows a quick strike of will of these guys have. They can put up points from anywhere on the field. lines up for the point after and it's up the extra point attempt is good and so John they overcome their field position at the start of this drive in a hurry and come out of it with a touchdown that's a sign of a good coach you find the mismatches and you take advantage of them I wouldn't be surprised if they tried the same thing again in the next play when they have the ball on offense the tackle. Can't bring him down. Philadelphia has to get to work quickly, trailing by two touchdowns. The quarterback lines up with two backs behind him. Set. Down. Uh -huh. that all you got? Uh -huh. Dropping back to pass on first down. Rowing. The 30. A lot of space in front of him. Looking for leverage. That was a great run after the catch. Looks like the defense was caught out of position on that one. The secondary wasn't there to stop that guy after he made the reception. Number 25, the lone back. Ball on the 46-yard line. Tucks it away. Great fake. A lot of room to work with. And he's stuck at the 40. And John makes the throw and does it himself. What they have to do to stop that kind of play is get a good rush up the middle from the tackle and have the ends take an outside rush to keep them in the pocket. Well, that's what will happen. The teams has switch sides and will start the second quarter. So they'll lose yardage on that tackle by number 
for 58. Good work by the defensive line there. They got off the ball, got penetration, shut off those running lanes. He was looking for a hole, but the only thing he saw was a massive wall of defenders. Buffalo calls a timeout. They have two timeouts left. Here are the numbers when it comes to third down conversions. Third down conversions is a keeper stat. When you convert on third down, you keep three things. You keep your drive going, you keep their defense on the field, and you keep your defense resting on the sideline. This is a good special teams play. You'll have to really get it because it'll be about a 53-yard attempt. The kick is up. It had the distance, but it sailed right. Watch for a hole to open up the middle and send your guy through. Kelly sets up. That's a three-yard game. Get some time in the pocket and be patient with it. Don't force it into coverage. Man in motion. Drops back. Pressure. Flings it to the outside. Into the open field. Good connection there. This guy can make all the catches. He'll dig for the ones in the dirt. He's not afraid to go across the middle. And he has a knack for getting open when there's a lot of traffic around him. Calling an audible. Using motion. On the catch. Just about two yards in the run by the halfback. Tell your line to protect here. Tell your line to protect every play, not just here. You need to get some time back there and let someone get open. Steps up into the pocket. He's looking with the throw on the run. Thomas ran a nice round on that pass. Play. These days, offenses rely on a short, quick pass, and the receiver gaining lots of yards after the catch. Third and short. Ball on the 31-yard line. Kind of directing traffic. Third and inches. Number 41 in motion. It's the toss to the left. Here's an opening. He's at the 20. Thomas showed some nice moves on that run. Yeah, he exploded through the line. Then he used some shifty moves to create some extra yardage. Seven defensive backs in on this one. This is the sixth play of this drive. Dropping back. He surveys the field. Steps up into the pocket. Good coverage scheme there, creating a few close to the quarter. He's had a tough time making reads when the defense pitches up to his own. What you want to do is look to the middle of the field or the seam right between the corner and the safety for completion. Second and goal. Ball on the 11-yard line. The quarterback lines up with two backs behind him. Under pressure, guns it to the end zone. A little too much on that pass to the end zone. He found the lane, but he couldn't find the receiver. He has to do a better job setting his feet and getting into a good throwing position before he makes the throw. Drops back, pressure coming, surveying the field. And the quarterback gets dumped for the sack. His receiver might have had a step to the outside. The rush got to him just before he could get rid of it. Number 11 is heading onto the field for this field goal attempt. up and the kicker got all of that one 
And the kickoff team comes out onto the field. And he got all of that one. A great kick. He got all of it. Philadelphia needs two scores to get back into this one. First and ten. Ball on their own 20. Hand off to the tailback. A tackle at the 23 yard line. Four yard gain there. Stay guys. Moving left. The offense picks up some free yards. The offense will try to force the defense to make stupid penalties like that. Every bit of yardage helps. Number 25. A yard, maybe two on the draw. Buffalo comes out in their nickel pack with the throw. That one won't count since he was out of bounds. I'm not sure what happened there. That throw just got away from him a little bit. Closing in, gets the pass off. Right on the mark there to move the chains. And the thing is, the secondary looked a little on their heels on that one. They just couldn't converge on the ball in time, and now they get a whole new set of down. Hand it off. Still running. Running with purpose. The defense is going to need to try something different to slow down this running game. Second and two. Drops back. They give it to the halfback. He takes it straight up the middle for good yardage and the first. Hey, all he had to do was get behind those big old blockers and just keep pushing. The next thing you know, they're moving the chains. And this is the eighth play of this drive. Counter goes for a gain of about three. Second and seven coming up here. Ball on the 24-yard line. Gives the ball off. Nice pickup on the ground, maybe about six. A smart coach would call this one. Here's a look at the third down success rate of each team. Third down is when you want your players to dig deep and make a clutch play. When you convert, it gives your defense a little extra rest, and it gives your offense a fresh set of downs to work with. Give this one a try. It's first and ten. Ball on the 15-yard line. Two minutes left in the quarter. A smart coach would call this one. The quarterback lines up with two backs behind him. Cunningham gets set. Drops back. Pressure. Throwing. It's caught. He throws a perfect strike. That was one heck of a throw. You could see him setting for the pass, then boom, it was gone. The quarterback is calling them back to the line of scrimmage. And it looks like there's a penalty on the play. So it's first and goal. For the end zone. Almost got. Almost picked it off in the end zone. Yeah, if he could have come up with that one, not only does it take away the scoring threat, but it gets the ball back for your offense. Second down is usually the time they'll call for a play pass. So they need to play discipline, not to bite too hard. To the end zone. Touchdown, Philadelphia. He delivered that pass right on time. Perfect for the touchdown. The quarterback went through his progression and found a receiver that he thought had the best chance to haul it in for the score. Number seven comes in for the extra point. And it's on its way. 
the point after is good. But John, these teams are very evenly matched. This makes for a better game, I think. The strategy of the game comes into play here more. Boomin kick downfield. They turn their last possession into three points. Let's see what they do with the ball this time around. They see something in the defense. There he goes. Just won't go down. He goes down at the 28 yard line. The defense can't afford to take too many gambles. They're going for a pick when they should just try and knock it down. One mistake can lead to a big play for the offense. Three, Looks like he's changing the play. Yellow, 74. You got it. Red, Come on, Number 41 in motion. Going to the left. They blitz in the back five. Yeah, that's a chance you take. You're hoping to get some penetration and hit him in the backfield. But if you miss, there isn't a lot of help at the next level to keep him from picking up the first down. Hey, this is why you run those two-minute drills and crack in a situation like this. The only difference is this isn't the scout team defense. Now they're looking at second and long after the sack. Under pressure, looking for a receiver, and the catch is made. He found a soft spot in the coverage, John. The receiver did a great job reading the coverage. He found a hole in the zone, and the quarterback found him in that hole with the pass. Pressure coming. He surveys the field with the pass. Breaking free. Tackle at the 49. Good job of bringing the pass in. This guy can really move. He turns things up two or three notches when it really counts. That's the kind of thing you love to see as a coach. Guys who have that second and third gear. Closing in. He's looking. Rolling right. Rowing. Brought down to the turf. Blitz almost got to him there, John. You don't always have to get to the quarterback when you blitz effectively. Football's about rhythm and timing. Bring an extra guy that makes him throw the ball before he wants to can upset that time. Drops back, steps up into the pocket. With the throw, the 30. Buffalo will call a timeout here. They have none remaining. Number 11 comes into the game to try the field goal. And it's up. The kick is good. No hesitation by the coach there, and he's rewarded by his kicker's second successful attempt. Here's the kickoff team. He got all of that one. He got all of it. This play might work. First and ten. Cunningham gets set. Is that all you got? Receives the handoff. The end of the second quarter with the score. Buffalo 20. Philadelphia 10. Let's get back to the play on the field. As we get set for the kickoff, here's a look at the halftime stats. And he got all of that one. A great kick. He lost it. The Eagles. Give it up. Give this defense a shot. Following the turnover now, it's first and ten. Stay up. Hit him low. Set. Huh. Going to the left. One yard gained by the running back. Give this defense a shot. Number 25 in the back. Gets the pass off. He did a nice job bringing that one in. Yeah, either that or it just got thrown in there so hard it stuck. Melissa, do you have an update for us? Hi, Al. The coach is pleased that his team leads right now, but he has concerns about his defense. He's disappointed in the lack of intensity and the missed tackles that have resulted in big plays. 
He knows that rapid improvement is needed if they hope to protect this lead. Al? Thanks, Melissa. Crossplay to the right. Big over. Fires. Barely makes it past the first down marker. This defense might work. Defense is extremely active and effective up front. They do a good job of getting upfield quickly, creating havoc in the backfield. Misdirection plays and draws can be a good way to use their speed and aggressiveness against them. Dropping back, pressure, throws it, and he hits his target. Picked up about six yards that time. Gain of six on the play. Third and goal. Ball on the four yard line. Good on the Fires. Touchdown, Philadelphia. Now this is exactly how to get the ball in the end zone. Just get in behind the center guard and keep pushing and pushing until they're putting up six points in the board. The kicker lines up for the point after. And it's on its way. The extra point attempt is good. And so they didn't have very far to go and were able to take advantage of that and get the touchdown. Whether it's your special teams or defense that sets you up with great field position, your job as an offense is to take advantage of it. And they did it right there. Buffalo has held on and is now looking to move ahead. Try to catch a defense snapper. Take the run and look to send it deep. Get set. Calling an audible now. Number 84. The man in motion. Came off to the tailback. Great play in the backfield. He came with a blitz and there wasn't anywhere to go. Yeah, and that's why you send all those guys to plug up the hole. At that time, there were no holes at all. With two extra defensive backs. The defense is in the dime. Lose it, lose it. Man in motion. Let's go, come on. Get up low. Under pressure, surveying the field. Good play in the backfield by number 74. Nowhere to throw at that time. Nowhere to run either. He's got to do a better job of reading the defense before the snap. Then get the ball out to your check down receiver before the rush can get to you. Changing the play now. Pressure coming, looking for a receiver. Rolling right, rolls right. Scrambling, breaks free. Down he goes, at the 12. Long yardage, and yet the quarterback tried to move the ball on the ground. You hate to see a team put their quarterback in a situation like that when they need to pick up this kind of yardage. So three and out, and they'll line up to punt. Here's the punt. That one slips right through his hands. The Eagles are there to pick up the ball. Here's a good defense for this situation. Following the turnover now, it's first and ten. Using motion. Cowboy! Hook out right! Cowboy! Going to the air on first down. Closing in. Ooh, that'll be 15 yards, no question. You see what he did was he grabbed it and he held on to it and he tried to bring him down with it. Now, if he would have just grabbed it and let go, it would have been a five-yard penalty. Number 25, the deep back, Cunningham, with a man in motion. Fire out! Going to the right. Number 25, didn't get any help from his offensive line. It was just about impossible to run when you have guys in the backfield just as soon as you snap the ball. Bring that pain, buddy. Gets rid of it. Right in stride. Fine. Great play there by Williams. You talk about making it look easy out there. He caught that, and he made it look very easy.
The corners move up to play this one tight. Pickup of about a yard in the run. The quarterback gets set with only one back behind him. Looks like they'll play bump and run on the outside. So they've had a lot of success so far in the red zone, and they'll try, obviously, to continue that here. Pressure, firing the ball into the end zone. Ooh, a big drop by the receiver. This is not the area to be dropping passes. To be a great receiver in this league, you have to catch the ball if the quarterback gets it to you in the end zone. This defense comes up with a big stop. They back up in their own end zone, trying to keep those guys off the board, and they make a play like that. That's a heck of a defensive play. A field goal here ties this game up. The kick is up. Number seven. It's three points to the board with that kick, his second so far. The kickoff team lines up. Sends it still. From the four. The 30. It's still pretty early, but it's been an even game so far. We'll have to see who can take control on this crowd. Pass play here on first down. Under pressure. It's a big drive. He never hesitated on that pass. That was quite a throw. This guy's been blessed with a golden arm. Gets the call, picks up four, maybe five there. Use some motion to throw off the defense. Don't let him get too comfortable. dump off on that play. The screen play is a key pass to have built into your offense. It's high percentage, gives a quarterback confidence, and gets him into a little rhythm. He's taken down at the 31-yard line. Be patient out there. When you see an opportunity, that's when you attack. But don't force it. Kelly sets up. Pressure coming. Looking for an option. And he makes the grab. They went back to the screen. The screen pass requires that you have some quick linemen who can move wide of the tackle and set up blocks for the guy coming out of the backfield. Man in motion. With the pass, off to ball, he makes the catch anyway. He's at the 20. Good throw, good catch to move the chains. You know, as a receiver, all you have to do is get a step. And this guy's going to put the ball on you. After three, it's all tied up. Philadelphia, 20. Buffalo, 20. The teams are set for the fourth quarter of play. This guy always gives maximum effort on every play. It doesn't matter if you're asking him to run between the tackles or outside. He just takes the ball and refuses to be brought down by the tackler. Gets rid of it. Not wanting to take a sack to force the issue. He throws that one way out of bounds. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 13-yard line. And he's brought down at the 12. Just about two yards on the run by the halfback. 
The Bills line up in a five receiver set this time. And this is the ninth play of this drive. Gets the pass off. It's a good stride. Nice pass and good catch on that play. The pass was fired in there so hard, I think he left smoke in the ball. So it's first and goal. Changing the play now. Cross play to the left. Thomas wasn't able to get anything going in that play. They got there and shut that play down very quickly. That's just a case of studying game film this week paying off. When you know what they like to run in certain situations, you can anticipate the play call and stop the play before it even gets started. in throws it and it's complete touchdown Buffalo and he slings it in there for the touchdown that's just a quick move by the receiver and a pass that was right on target from the quarterback so he found his target and for the third time it goes for a touchdown Zip. number 11 comes in to attempt the point after Hut. and it's on its way the point after is good the offense was out there for a good part of the quarter, John. Ten plays and a touchdown against that defense. You pound the defense for more than ten plays, and then you punch it home for a touchdown. Now that is an offensive series. The defense has to find a way to regroup out there in the sideline so they don't have that kind of thing happen to them in the next round. From the one. Philadelphia takes over on offense, needing a touchdown to draw in. Good blocking up front and a nice spin on the counter. Yeah, and that was a perfect call in that situation. He did a nice job avoiding the first wave of defenders, then converting for the first down. Number 25. About a two-yard gain here. The Bills come out in the quarter defense. Dropping back, pressure, fires it onto the left. And he makes the grab. Cunningham fires it in there for a first down. Oh, he really puts some mustard on that one. That's what happens when you put everything you've got into a throw. Again, he'll get the call. Big opening. The 40. He wasn't satisfied with just picking up the first down on that carry. And you love to see this kind of explosiveness in the second half. A run like that could mean the defense is tired. To the air on first down. Passing to the left. Perfect throw. Pickup of about seven. Ah, this is a good one to call. Second and maybe three. Hit him low. Number 25, the long back. It's rid of it. Won't have to break stride. Cunningham with a hot hand on this drive. And what he's doing is sitting back there in the pocket, seeing everything, making great decisions, and getting the ball to the right guy. He's playing very well right now. Get out of this team has been unstoppable inside the red zone today. Maybe a yard on that counterplay. No more. A smart coach would call this one. Second and nine. Ball on the 15-yard line. Get out now. Bring that pain, baby. Dropping back. Under pressure, throws it. The catch was made out of bounds. And the only call there that can really save you is a situation if the official determines that you would have come down in bounds, but a defender pushes you out while you're up in the air. And that clearly didn't happen there. Gets the pass off. Ooh, nearly picked off. John, I don't know how they didn't pick that one off. You know, he didn't pick it off, but at least he didn't let the receiver make the catch either. Still a pretty good effort. 
number seven. Heads out onto the field for the field goal attempt. The kick is up. Through the uprights and good. That's his third successful attempt. Smith, he's back for the kickoff as we take a quick glance at his return numbers. Should be a return here. The offense with a lot of success through the air on the last drive as they move downfield for the touchdown. They line up in the I formation. First and ten. Come on, partner. Set. John, he's hurt. We'll get an update from Melissa as soon as the extent of the injury is known. Second and nine. Ball on their own 16. With the pass, this pass is incomplete. That one hit him in the hands, but he just couldn't hang on. Pretty good play call on that one. Everything happened just as it's drawn up. Just couldn't hang on to it. Dimebacks in for this play. The Bills using motion. Flings it to the outside. A lot of room to work with. That reception moves the chains, and they pick up a first down. And as a receiver, you have to be ready for any type of pass. He did a good job of hanging on to that last one because it got there in a hurry. Set. Yo, Changing the play 15. now. down at the 33 yard line the running back gets about three run the football good running game will really open up the path melissa do you have an update for us good news al the trainer said he did sustain an injury but it doesn't appear to be anything serious his return is probable that was melissa stark with her sideline report kelly sends a man in motion hand it off and he's walked down in the backfield Loss of around two. You got a ways to go for the first down. So he's going to need a little time back there in that pocket. Set. Bring the pain. Here come the heat. Hut. Pressure coming. Looking for a receiver. Throws it. The 40. You can't draw it up any better than that. Textbook first down. First and ten. Ball on the 45-yard line. Seventh play of this drive. And he's tackled at the 47-yard line. Keep this to the inside. You just need to run that clock down. Throwing right on target. They'll mark it at the 41. All you need to do here is run some clock. Run the football up the middle. Set. Two minutes to go. Run it up the gut and keep First that and clock ten. moving. Ball on the 41-yard line. Set. Ninth play of this drive. Just about seven yards on that carry. The Eagles call a timeout. They have two timeouts remaining. Two yards to go. Calling an audible now. Using motion. Going to the left. The Eagles call a timeout. That's their second. Third and one. Ball on the 32 yard line. And we can attribute this lead to their ability to convert on third down. Man in motion. Crosses it left. 
off and run. Again, they convert on third down. And you're right about that. Three different third downs on this drive, and all three, they picked up the first. They just can't get the offense off the field. So they have first and 10 here. Ball on the 21-yard line. 12th play of this drive. The Eagles call a timeout. They have no timeouts left. I'm guessing this should be a run. The defense can't be lollygagging around, because if they are and they give up a first, this one's over. So as they get set to try to convert, here's what both teams have done on third down. Third down conversions are usually a good barometer of how well your offense is playing. It means that your offense is making big plays when they need them. And time runs out. The game is over. The final score is Buffalo 27, Philadelphia 23. For EA Sports, this is Al Michaels and John Madden wishing you a very pleasant good evening. Kelly is our horse trailer player of the game tonight.